Now, let's talk turkey. Let's talk about smoking a turkey. A different way to do this. Who doesn't love smoked anything? Right. Now, if you're gonna smoke a turkey, I would highly recommend you probably don't go past the 10 to 12 pound range because you know there's temperature issues right. and fitting it in the smoker and, and so on and so forth. You wanna get that internal temperature up to about 165 degrees. You, want to make, you, don't, want, you don't want everybody to be sick. That's right. <laughs> but this can be one of the tastiest ways in the world to fix a turkey. Now, one of the first things you have to do is brine the turkey. Now, this is okay. a brine. This recipe is old, 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 but it's very simple. I'm going to give you the basic ingredients to this. You're going to take per gallon of water, one cup of kosher salt, one cup of brown sugar, two tablespoons of black pepper. I use the coarse ground, so on and so forth. If you want to put just a little bit of soy, I'd say per gallon, a half a cup or so. That'll give it that nice salty taste. Also, we're going to take a little bit of liquid smoke seasoning, just maybe like a cap full or less. You can use a little bit of thyme, a teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Mix that in because you always love that thyme taste when it comes to poultry. One other thing that we're going to do and put in this brown is some garlic powder. Let's put two tablespoons of that as well. Okay. Just a dash of Worcestershire. Okay. Now that makes a nice brine. What you're going to do, we're going to dump these in here in the gallon of water. Now what I try to do is try to find a pan that is high enough and tight enough to the bird where you don't have to use as much brine. Right. So if you can cover that in a gallon, that's great. If not, two use more. a gallon, two gallons, so on and so forth. Again, this is a 12 pound bird. I don't go much over that if I'm going to smoke it. We're going to start the brine. We're going to put all the ingredients in here, okay. bring it to a simmer, then set it off and then set it in the refrigerator and let it cool. Then you set the bird in there, mix it all up, set it back in the refrigerator and let it go for 12 to 14, 16 hours, depending on how much flavor you want in it. So I'm gonna start with the gallon ingredients, bring it up to a simmer. And here's our cup of brown sugar, black pepper. Now I like my black pepper. Half a cup of soy, and a little bit of smoke flavor, some thyme, Okay, two tablespoons of garlic powder, just a dash of Worcestershire. So now we're just gonna bring this to a simmer and then cool it back down, drop our bird in there. So we're well on our way towards getting a first class bird. I'm excited, I'm, smoker. I can't wait to eat that. Last time I had smoked turkey, I shouldn't tell this story. You should tell, it was funny. I was with Kentucky Field and we're on the road mm -hmm. and you don't know where you're gonna get your snacks sometimes. Right. You're just, you just, where you are. So I went into this gas station and they had a smoked turkey leg. Really? It was like in this machine keep yeah. warm. I don't know how long it had been there. Three weeks. I grabbed that thing, pulled out and started eating it. I thought, man, this is good. What? I was sick for about a week and a really? half. Really? Oh, you remember that? Don't get your smoked turkey at a gas station. Okay. If you do, just look at the expiration date. On the turkey wing? On the or turkey the bowl? <laughs> Just make sure. I don't know, there might be some really good turkey Smoke turkey in gas station somewhere. I've never seen it in a gas station. That's all I got to say about that. So again, we're going to bring this to a simmer. You don't want to boil it. You just right. kind of get everything, the sugars and the salt, acquainted, okay. as my grandfather would say. All right. So later on, in the fridge, okay. bird goes to sleep for about 12, 14 hours. We get up tomorrow. We're going to put our cherry or apple. I haven't decided yet in the electric smoker. Now, mm -hmm. I like an electric smoker. We have both kinds. I have a big smoker that we can use for all kinds of things, but I'm, tomorrow we're gonna be busy. We got yeah. a lot of stuff going on. I like to be able to digitally dial my number and my time in. Mm -hmm. And you, there's a, also a, I can insert a probe into that breast meat. So when it's getting around 165, I need to know. Now here's something I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a little heads up on too. When we're done, we're gonna wrap this in foil. Then we're gonna stick it in the cooler just a little while. Mm -hmm. That's set for about an hour. Does wonderful yeah. things to it. I'm excited. Oh, I'm fired up. I really am. Now that doesn't look like a 12 pound turkey, but it is a 12 pound turkey. So we're ready to roll. Yay. Are you excited? I'm excited. Let me I'm see excited like. Now we've preheated our smoker. It's cold outside, so we've got this on the back porch. So we're going to take some butter and we're going to put, I would say, probably a half a teaspoon of rosemary, half a teaspoon of thyme. I'm going to take some Tella cherry pepper. That's rumored 
what the kernel used in Kentucky Fried Chicken. I'm gonna take some salt, just enough to, I'd say, a quarter of a teaspoon of each. Don't forget a little granulated garlic in there as well. And we're gonna cover the breast of this turkey with the butter and those spices. Oh man, I've already got <laughs> images of this guy in a couple hours. Now we have our cherry soaking. We're gonna use cherry wood. I'm gonna soak those just a little bit. I like to go about 250. Now at 250 degrees, you're talking 30 minutes per pound. If you're gonna put a probe in, you can go into the breast or the deepest part of the thigh. You need to get to 165. That's where you know you're good. Ladies and gentlemen, for your viewing pleasure, Happy Thanksgiving! <laughs> We've been waiting for this moment. Mm -hmm. Now, let me tell you what. You want to blow everybody away and serve them the best turkey they've ever had. Yum. Ever. Yum. Why do you smell this, Nick? <laughs> it smells delicious. Can I have some? I want you to look at this. Golden, beautiful, and that smoke smell. It's like a picture in a magazine. I love it. It is like a picture magazine. But the smell is beyond belief. Mm -hmm. Now, one thing I do want to say about this, let's, let's go back and just reiterate just a little bit. All right, first of all, this is a 12-pound bird. Right. All right. We soaked it about 12, 14 hours. Mm -hmm. Then we cooked it at 240, 245. It was cold outside. Yeah. We also popped an orange in here just to kind of once it get heated up, that would fill that space. Right. Now, I pin these wings down with a toothpick so it would have that beautiful, wonderful shape. Good job. I can't hardly talk from my mouth water. <laughs> if you want to try something, I'm telling you, for Thanksgiving, just blow everybody's mind out. And juicy? Oh, oh wow. my goodness. Should we cut it? Or yes. do we just want to stare at it for a while? You, uh, I'll eat it and you just watch. How's mm -hmm. that? Let's just do a little cut down the prime. Now again, 165, then we put it in a cooler. I'm just slicing off it just to like the perfect piece here. Yum. We put it in a cooler for an hour in aluminum foil. Now, yeah. here's what you're gonna notice. You're gonna notice a little pink color. That's not because it's not done. That's from the smoking process. Mrs. Farmer. You must love me if I get to go first. <sighs> Look how moist and juicy that is. It's terrible, you don't want any. <laughs> is oh, that not wow. perfect? You're gonna have to make, for Thanksgiving, two of these. Make two of them because we got a bunch of people mm. Oh, wow. That's the best turkey I've ever had. Good job. Now, you're probably, the question they're gonna be asking if you don't have a smoker, I would highly, highly recommend an electric smoker. We use, what is it, Masterbuilt? Yeah. It's digital. You put in your commands, mm -hmm. your temperature, your time. Walk away. And you walk away. They have probes too, if you wanna check to see what your internal temperature is. Right. You go ahead and pop it in where you want it. Look at this thing steaming, juicy, Got that nice smoke flavor. Something else you're probably gonna ask, well, how often do I have to change the chips? I don't overdo the smoke. I put some in at the beginning, mm -hmm. and then I put some in midway. You don't overwhelm this, but you have, oh. Mm. And again, we did cherry wood on this one. This is so easy to do. Once you figure it out, you're gonna be doing a lot of stuff. This is so good. The electric smoker, 150 bucks on sale. And you mm -hmm. use it a lot. We're gonna do a lot more smoke stuff coming up this year. We got so many good recipes for you. This has been a wonderful season, our sixth year. It has. We got a bunch of brand new shows coming up. But being that our very busy day, from cattle to turkeys to the store, all over the place, this is the star though. Yes, it is. This is the star. And I'm just the most keeping beautiful, it. Beautiful, delicious turkey you'll ever make in your life. Mm. And if you want more recipes, especially sides, where would you go, Mrs. Farmer? You can talk with your mouthful. TimFarmersCountryKitchen.com. This is exactly good. Right. TimFarmersCountryKitchen.com. <laughs> Mrs. Farmer, how many sides do we have? A gazillion? 50 million. 
And a lot of these shows have only been seen one time. So right. if you're looking for some sides for Thanksgiving, cranberry, cranberry sauce, sauce, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese, yeah, yeah. sweet whatever potatoes, you want. No. we've got them. So look at our sides, knock yourself out, have a happy Thanksgiving, That's and try right. to gain some weight. You're looking <laughs> thin out there. Also, go to shows, then YouTube, boom. Now, if you were on Facebook, and you want to go see Tim Farmer's Country Kitchen. Did you know there was a Facebook page? I do. It? I knew that. What do you have to do to become our friend? Hit like. That's it. Boom. You're on. We talk. We share recipes. Every Monday you share your recipes with us. This half hour's up. Look what a beauty. One more time. Just look. Just look. Just smell. Smell that. That's a magazine turkey. Can you smell that? <laughs> and remember, it's all about... Good times. Good friends. And really good eats. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving.